Emil Nolt, born Emil Hansen, August 7, 1867, April 13, 1956, was a German-Danish painter and printmaker. He was one of the first Expressionists, a member of Die Brock, and is considered to be one of the great oil painting and watercolor painters of the 20th century. He is known for his vigorous brushwork and expressive choice of colors. Golden yellows and deep reds appear frequently in his work, giving a luminous quality to otherwise somber tones. His watercolors include vivid, brooding stormscapes and brilliant florals. Nold's intense preoccupation with the subject of flowers reflects his continuing interest in the art of Vincent van Gogh. Iography Emil Nold was born as Emil Hansen near the village of Nold. Since 1920 part of the municipality of Birkeland Southern Jutland, Denmark, in the Prussian Duchy of Schleswig. He grew up on a farm, his parents, devout Protestants, were Frisian and Danish peasants. He realized his unsuitability for farm life and that he and his three brothers were not at all alike. Between 1884 and 1891, he studied to become a carver and illustrator in Flensburg and worked in furniture factories as a young adult. He spent his years of travel in Munich, Karlsruhe and Berlin. In 1889, he gained entrance into the School of Applied Arts in Karlsruhe. Citation needed, from 1892 to 1898 he was a drawing instructor at the School of the Museum of Industrial and Applied Arts, Industry and Geo-Urbe Museum, today the Textile Museum or Textile Museum, in Street Gallen, Switzerland. He eventually left this job to finally pursue his dream of becoming an independent artist. As a child he had loved to paint and draw, but he was already 31 by the time he pursued a career as an artist. When he was rejected by the Munich Academy of Fine Arts in 1898, he spent the next three years taking private painting classes, visiting Paris, and becoming familiar with the contemporary Impressionist scene that was popular at this time. He married Danish actress Ada Vilstrup in 1902 and moved to Berlin, where he would meet collector Gustav Siefler and artist Karl schmidt rottluff both of whom would advocate his work later in life. He became a member of the revolutionary Expressionist group Die Brock, The Bridge, of Dresden, in 1906. Upon the group's invitation, this association lasted only until the end of the following year. From 1908 to 1910 he was a member of the Berlin Secession, before being excluded in 1910 due to a disagreement with the leadership. In 1912 he exhibited with Kandinsky's Munich-based group Der Blaue Reiter, the Blue Reiter. He had achieved some fame by this time and was able to support himself through his art. From 1902 he called himself after his birthplace. Nold was a supporter of the Nazi party from the early 1920s, having become a member of its Danish section. He expressed negative opinions about Jewish artists, and considered Expressionism to be a distinctively Germanic style. This view was shared by some other members of the Nazi party, notably Joseph Goebbels and Fritz Hitler. However Hitler rejected all forms of modernism as degenerate art, and the Nazi regime officially condemned Nold's work. Until the time he had been held in great prestige in Germany. A total of 1,052 of his works were removed from museums, more than those of any other artist. 4. Some were included in the Degenerate Art Exhibition of 1937, despite his protests, including, later, a personal appeal to Nazi Gaul Leiterbald der Vonsier in Vienna. He was not allowed to paint, even in private, after 1941. Nevertheless, during this period he created hundreds of watercolors, which he hid. He called them the unpainted pictures. In 1942 Noel wrote, There is silver blue, sky blue and thunder blue. Every color holds within it a soul, which makes me happy or repels me and which acts as a stimulus. To a person who has no art in him, 
colors are colors, tones tones dot 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 and that is all. All their consequences for the human spirit, which range between heaven to hell, just go unnoticed. After World War II, Noel was once again honored, receiving the German Order of Merit, West Germany's highest civilian decoration. He died in Siebel, now part of Neukirchen. Apart from paintings, Nold's work includes many prints, often in color, and watercolor paintings of varied subjects, landscapes, religious images, flowers, stormy seas and scenes from Berlin nightlife. A famous series of paintings covers the German New Guinea expedition, visiting the South Seas, Moscow, Siberia, Korea, Japan, and China. The Seefler catalog rising of his prints describes 231 etchings, 197 woodcuts, 83 lithographs, and 4 hectographs. Mm.